Okay, come on. All right, you guys, let's see the positions. Members of the press, I would like to thank you all for being here today to talk about the human rights abuser Sodexo and to make clear that Northeastern takes a strong stand against this exploitative company. While there are many points to be raised, I'll cut to the chase. Northeastern is now ready to concede to the voices of the student body and reject the bid of Sodexo to take over dining services. Wait, what is a Sodexo? Sodexo is a multinational corporation that does food service at college campuses. It makes a billion dollars in profit every year by paying poverty wages that force its workers to rely on government welfare just to provide for their families. M Mr. President, I'm sorry, could you please clarify what exactly does Northeastern uh, have anything to do with Sodexo? What does Sodexo want with Northeastern? I apologize. Many of you probably don't know about this, but Sodexo is bidding to take over operations at dining halls at Northeastern. Despite the fact this was not a transparent or public process, Many, many students have reached out to the administration and expressed their concern about this corporation. Uh, President, uh, what are students' concerns regarding Sodexo? Well, Sodexo is now known around the world for paying poverty level wages to its cafeteria workers and intimidating those who exercise their legal right to form unions. Also, the food's apparently not very good and there have been cases of poisoning. Sodexo has even fired workers just for speaking out about their poor working conditions. When we consider these disturbing facts about this company, we realise that a company like Sodexo has no place at Northeastern University. This company's actions directly contradict our values as global citizens. We have a responsibility to raise the bar of fair practices on campus and be a leader on issues of social and economic justice. To continue to run from this responsibility would be shameful to such a proud institution. Therefore, Northeastern University says no to Sword Exo. April Fools!